Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from English Excel. In today's video, I am going to discuss about basic terminology used in HPLC analysis. Friends, if you are working in QC lab or want to join in the QC library, so you must know the terminology which I am going to discuss. Number one is chromatography. Chromatography is a separation technique from a mixture of solvent into individual components. Next is chromatogram. Chromatogram is a plot of detector signal output versus time or elevation volume. Next is mobile phase. Mobile phase is a liquid that moves the solute through the column. Next is stationary phase. The packing material of the column which is immobile phase involved in the chromatography process. Next is peak. The visual representation on the chromatogram based on the detector's electrical response due to the presence of a sample component inside the flow cell. Next is retention time, RT. The time taken by the analyte peak to reach the detector after sample injection is called retention time. Next is relative retention time, RRT. RRT is the comparison of retention time from one peak to another. Next is qualitation. Qualitation an analysis process which is designed to identify the components of a substance or mixture. Next is quantitation. Quantitation and analysis process which is designed to determine the amounts or proportion of the components of a substance. Next is normal phase mode. In normal phase mode, stationary phase is polar property and mobile phase is nonpolar property. Next is reversed phase chromatography. In reversed phase chromatography, stationary phase is nonpolar property and mobile phase is polar property. Next is isocratic elevation. Isocratic elevation refers to maintaining a constant concentration in the mobile phase. Next is gradient elevation. Gradient elevation refers to maintaining a varying concentration in the mobile phase. Next is system suitability SST. Before start of the analysis of the chromatograph system like HPLC, GC, system suitability has to perform to know the system is working properly or to know the performance. Next is telling factor. It is defined as the distance from the front slope of the peak to the back slope divided by twice the distance from the central line of the peak to the front slope with all measurements made at 5% of the maximum peak height. Next is resolution. Resolution of a elevation is a quantitative measure of how well two elevation peaks can be differentiated in a chromatographic separation. Next is LOD and LOQ. Limit of detection LOD and limit of quantification LOQ are two important performance characteristics in method validation. LOD and LOQ are terms used to describe the smallest concentration of an analyte. Next is elevation. Elevation is the passing of mobile phase through the chromatographic bed to transport solutes. Next is inlet, the part of the column where the mobile phase and the solute enter. Next is degassing. Degassing is the process of removing dissolved gases from the mobile phase. Next is purging. Purging is the process of removing air bubbles from the all four lines of HPLC pump. Next is RSD or percentage RSD. The relative standard deviation 
आर एस डी और परसेंटेज आर एस डी इज द एब्सोल्यूट वैल्यू ऑफ द कोफिशियंट ऑफ वेरिएशन एंड द लास्ट वन इज बेस लाइन बेस लाइन इज द डिटेक्ट सिग्नल वर्सेस टाइम इफ नो पिक्स आर प्रेजेंट गुड इंडिकेटर ऑफ पल्सिंग एयर बबल और इलेक्ट्रिकल नॉइस फ्रेंड्स आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड द बेसिक टर्मिनोलॉजी यूज्ड इन एच पी एल सी एनालिसिस थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग